Hello, it's Monday, October the 18th, 2010, and I'm Martin Smith with a daily outlook from MaxiForex. Friday saw the dollar losing momentum to reach another 10-month low, only to strengthen towards the end of the trading day. Most of the volatility was seen during the Bernanke speech, where he hinted towards interest rates not moving and the need for additional stimulus. Other than Bernanke's speech about the new quantitative easing program, core CPI came out at 0% versus an expected 0.10%. Core retail sales came out as expected at 0.40%. Crude decreased by 1.7% to close at $81.25 a barrel, and gold declined slightly by minus 0.4% to close at $1,372 an ounce. Although Friday saw the euro strengthen against the dollar to break the 10-month high and reach 141.56, the pair lost momentum and fell sharply during the American session. As long as the euro dollar is above 139.90, the trend is slightly bullish. We may be witnessing a slight correction based on overbought conditions, and a bearish tone may settle in if the market breaks Friday's low of 139.35. Overall, the euro dollar traded with a low of 138.61 and a high of 138.95. There's no economic data today. The pound continued to rise against the dollar to break the much-tested 160.60. The pound dollar on the daily chart is still above its moving average, and if the pair breaks 159.70, it might push the pair lower to 159. The pair reached a low of 159.14 and a high of 159.49. Today, no economic data is expected. Friday saw the yen strengthen dramatically against the dollar to return to its 15-year low of 80.86. Last night saw the yen strengthen slightly. The momentum for the pair is still bearish as long as the dollar yen remains below 81.50. Overall, the dollar yen traded with a low of 81.13 and a high of 81.40. Today, no economic data is expected. The Canadian dollar strengthened versus the dollar advancing 150 pips from parity. Friday's announcement of manufacturing sales was much higher than expected and came out at 2% versus 0.5%. Momentum of the dollar CAD seems to be positive as long as the pair remains above 10080. Overall, the dollar CAD traded with a low of 1001 and a high of 1095. Today, no economic data is expected. That's it from me. Be sure to visit us at maxiforex.ru.